Hey everybody, welcome to my usual me and welcome back to the long dark. We're gonna this is Gun Loper. And we are gonna go to the far territory today. We're gonna actually try to get to the airfield as soon as I can. I think I feel geared enough that we're gonna be able to do that. Let me go ahead and that's Zeus you see on your screen. Let's flip that so that you guys can see what I see. All right, I'm right here at Timberwolf Mountain right now. Before I start though, it's nighttime. We need to sleep uh, real quick. We're in Timberwolf Mountain. Uh, hello, Nightmare44. Ian, how you doing? Jabba, good to see you. Uh, Mr. Brady, hello, hello. Uh, Kate Key One, I'm going to call you Key One. Um, how you doing? Let's do three hours at a time here. Sam Merritt, Tracy Graham, Rob King. What's this about you having to look down for two weeks? I don't know what that is, Rob. Uh, Canadian guy, what's up? Northern Lights, hello, hello. How's everybody doing? I think I got everybody. Yeah, I hope you're feeling better, dude. Jennifer, hi, hi. Caught picking 88, hello. Tyler, what's up? Squirrel nutty. True, true, mother badger. Christina, hi. All right, it's daytime now. Is the weather better? It is better. All right, so we need to get our, the rest of our stuff and get out of here. I don't think I'm going to eat that moose because I'm afraid. Wait, actually, I, I've got, don't I have meat on me? I do. Oh, I do. It's moldy, though. We have cattails. We're going to drop that because I'm not level 5 cooking yet, so I can't take a risk right out of the gate in the morning. We are 80 out of 99 pounds. I need to make sure I have food. But let's see. What do we got here? I don't think there's anything else I wanted to, to get or make. I don't care about the feathers. Um, I'm going to take these casings. We're going to drop these at the cave. Um, like, I'm going to live stream until I get to the airfield today. Okay? I want the Von's, I want Von's rifle. Take these casings. Um, I'm also going to take all these matches and that herbal tea for sure, for sure. I don't know that one cup of coffee is going to make that much of a difference. It's only weighs 0.02 though. Let's take it. All right. I'm 89 out of 99 pounds. So I'll be a pound over. Do I have any water on me? Okay, so after I drink this water, I'll be good. If I lose my bonus is what I'm saying. Um, we're going to go ahead and eat these cattails. We're going to be hunting along the way. Because I'm going to need to. Oh, 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 I got you, Rob. Okay, okay, okay. Wally. How's it going, Wally? Well, I hope you feel better soon. Okay, I don't know if there's anything else I want to take with me. I don't think so. Let's... Mm. I'm going to grab these cans because that'll be... If, not, if I don't have anything else... I can eat those, even though they're ruined. They will make me sick, but I do have antibiotics, so. Where's the rest of my antibiotics? Right here. We need those. Okay. Take that herbal tea, too. All right, now we're getting kind of up there in, in uh, weight. Well, we've got our 99 pounds. I don't, I'm going to leave that hammer here, guys. Oh, wait. Let me grab a gun cleaning kit. We're going to come back, I'm sure. All right. Down the hill we go. We're headed back to the, uh, to the cave so I can reorganize and uh, get some other stuff going. Actually, you know what? 
Hang on a second. I'm going to grab that other hide. Thought I heard something. You're back in Chicago. Cool. Eric Jenkins, thank you for that super chat. Really enjoy your content. I appreciate you for it. Well, thank you very much, Eric. I appreciate that. And thank you for that super chat, man. All right, let me grab that. That'll I need that hide, I think. I don't know how many hides I've got back at the house, but I should have some. I might. You are a hammer. I might have some some rabbits right here, maybe. Hmm. Oh no, I picked up those. I've got those on me, right? Those snares. Yeah, that one's done. I'm gonna drop that. I don't. I don't really care about that right now, and I don't want to take the time to to mess with it. Now I said this before. I'll say it again. There's enough rabbit spawns, at least until they do the. Um, the reworking of the animals. You should take some snares to the uh, to the uh, to the airfield. If you don't have any, I mean, or make some. Bring hide. I mean, I mean bring um, bring guts if nothing else, so you can make them. Because there's there's there's, some, there's several benches. So you'd want to you want you want snares. It's easier, man. You know what I mean? You don't need snares, but you get a lot more food f it, from snares than you do from just uh, hitting the rabbits with rocks in the head. All right. We did pretty good for not being, what day is it, by the way? It's day 44. For it not even being two months in, we did pretty good, I think. I need to get all my clothes um, fixed. And I kind of want another pair of, uh, I, I, want, I, I think I want a pair of uh, deer boots, is what I think. I mean, the cargo pants I've got are good. Oh, look at you. <laughs> Eric, number one fan. Thanks, buddy. Appreciate it, man. All right. Down we go. By the way, I did see your comments in my Discord. A couple of you, and that, that people, a couple of, uh, well, some people have been asking me to play Ixion again to f continue the story, and I will do that tomorrow. How about that? Uh, today was, uh, I, want, I just, I wanted to scratch that, that zomboid itch, so this morning I played zomboid, and tomorrow we'll play, uh, we'll play Ixion. I don't know what time I'll be on in the morning, but we'll, uh, we'll play that first, and then I'll play this again in the evening. That way I can either crash and burn, or, uh, we can, you know... Open up some new uh, some new areas. Can you wear a bear jacket and a wolf one or no? Yeah, I've got I've got I that's exactly what I'm wearing. I'm wearing a bear coat on the outside, a wolf skin coat on the inside. Uh, I might want to flip those uh, to be honest, because I think it's going to be easier for me to keep a a uh, a wolf skin jacket fixed than it is the bear skin coat. Yeah, at the end of the last episode, we 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 finished up the uh, wolfskin jacket, which is why I decided to go into to the uh, airfield. I'm only um, I'm only 41 degrees above the ambient, but some of my clothing needs to be fixed, and I need I need more. Like I don't have two pairs of long or thermal underwear. I'm hoping I'm going to find it at the airfield. I'm bummed. It's the only pair of thermals I I found so far. You didn't want to make it and not be able to wear it, yeah? Because because uh, with some animal products, you can only wear one of like like the hat. You can only wear one hat. Oh, I should have fixed that before I left. Seventy four percent. See what I mean? Jelly bean. I'm gonna drop down into this prepper cache and get warmed up real quick. It's. Not even noon yet. 
but I could use a couple hours of sleep, I think. Oh, I've got a long walk. Oh, you're dang right. That's why I said we're going to be, uh, as long as it takes me to get there today, that's what we're going to do. However many hours that is. I'm going to assume, and this might get me in trouble, but I'm going to assume that the airfield forge will have its own hammer. I expect it does. It, it has the last couple times. If it doesn't, um, might be in trouble. But I'm not gonna take. I'm not gonna take one with me. I think we'll be fine. Got two hours here. Snow track. Yep. Give me one second here. I'm gonna take a little sip of my my juice. Trying to keep my vitamin C up, man. All right, so I think that'll do. Drink the rest of this water. Snowshoes, that'd be cool. I imagine they might, I imagine they'll probably add snowshoes, but it's going to slow you down. I mean, I don't know if it would slow you down or not. I mean, in real life it would, so. Give me some skis, man. Let me slap my skis on and go zip. I would love to have cross-country skis in this game. I think it makes more sense than anything automa automated, like cars or whatever. Did I For a second, I was going to ask, did I get all my, my, my pistol ammo? And I did. Let's go ahead and reload that. I almost went the wrong way. Not the wrong way, but a more dangerous way. Go up. Oh, you won't let me? That's dumb. Well, they don't have any gas that you can siphon out of a out of a vehicle, so that's I mean, right now they'd have to add that too, which is fine. But I still would rather have skis, be able to take them off your off your feet, and then re uh, and then get on top of a hill, put them on, and outrun wolves. Are you kidding me? That'd be amazing. Shell casing. Even there were like little short, um, like little short skis, you know what I mean? That would make more sense for you carrying them around. But I heard a wolf. Take that soda. What do we got here? She's been hoarding those stems and hiding them in the piano. Oh, that's right. I forgot about that. God knows why. Deal with it? Question mark. There are, uh, yeah, there are um, stems in the in the church, in the piano in the church. We figured that out not too long ago. That was cool. I forgot about that. Man, I don't want to go all the way to Thompson's Crossing, though, right now. Hand pump, railroad cart. They thought about that. I saw it. They t uh, they t uh, um, Raphael um, tweeted that out. Guys, I don't think I have. I don't think I have. Um, I don't think we have. What you call it? Um, God, my brain's not working now. 
Sorry. I don't think we have batteries in this cars. Because this is interloper, but I just added guns, but I don't think it gave me um, any batteries to make new bullets. We might have what we have, and that's it, and I'll have to revert to a bow. So... Is it possible to find arrows or just arrowheads? On Voyager? Yeah, you'll find arrows. If you go down to the... to the Go down... Like One example of some arrows you can find are over there at the barn in Pleasant Valley. There's a, uh, there's a target, and it should have a few arrows in it. Some broken, some not. Never guaranteed to be uh, all there, but yeah. Uh, also in the, in the dam, I'll show you when we get there. Uh, there's uh, at the door you should find some in the door Going from the lower dam to the upper dam Am I stuck? Shimmy shimmy shake. Let's go. Whoa. Oh How many bandages do I have four? Okay, I gotta be careful. No, I don't have stump remover. Although I will have to make some gunpowder if I if I if I want to. If I want to make bullets. Uh oh, that's a trick right there. That wanted to trick me into going back up that slope. We're not going to do that. We got to get down, man. I got to get. It probably would have been faster just to go to Skeeter's Ridge and go down those ropes. That's what I'm thinking. All right, I've never been down this way, so. I mean, I have, but. I haven't shimmied down this far this way. Where am I? I mean, I see the the aspen forest there, but so I'm right behind the 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 barn. What is that? Is that a wolf? That's a deer. Okay. Without the antlers, these uh, these doe are, are looking like deer sometime. Occasionally. I'm actually not too far from Thompson's Crossing. Maybe we'll go to Thompson's Crossing real quick because I'm, I'm really close to it. Yeah, let's go there. That's fine. Although we might have a bear or a moose here. We'll follow this road, this creek down to Thompson's Crossing real fast. Did I ever check the rabbit traps? Yeah, they're they're actually in my pocket. I picked them up. One of them was broken. I didn't realize one of them was broken until just now. I threw it away. What is this? Nothing. Did they ever add another uh, gun uh, smithing workstation in the expansion area? Uh, no. No, they would have already put it in.
Yeah, no, hey, by the way, never don't no, never feel bad about um about you know coming in later or whatever and asking questions. That's fine. I uh I don't have a set schedule. So it's, I know it's hard for a lot of you guys to to come in and watch what you know, what I'm doing right out the gate. So I apologize on behalf of my lack of organization. Sometimes it just doesn't come together when I want it to, I guess. All right. Cattails, baby. I'd rather eat cattails because they're a sure thing and I won't get sick. I'm worried about getting hypothermia right now, though. I've been out here for a minute. I'm good. I'm good. You can cut across the field and go straight to Thompson's Crossing. How to do that? Uh, currently, no spicy wolves. However, if I do get attacked, I'm going to be in trouble because I'm really tired. So, I gotta watch that. We need to go find a place to crash out. Oh! Is this a bear cave? Shoot. Shoot. It's not a bear cave. It's a people cave. Let's go ahead and, and warm up here and have a little rest. Like a, Yeah, let's do a two hour rest. It's a 3.6 degree increase. This is a seven. Okay, let's go ahead and sleep for two hours. Stupid wolf. I'm be in trouble. Got one right outside my door. Uh, preventative measure. How was Zeus today? He's doing good. After the first live stream, I went and hung out with him for a little bit. He's doing just fine. I got to cut back on his snacks, though, because he's getting fat again. I don't like seeing his ribs, but when he starts getting roly-poly, it's time for him to cut back on, that, on them snacks for, uh, for a week or so. He's getting to the point where every time I bring it, or he comes back in the house after he goes to the bathroom, or any time I come out of the office, or any time I do, any, I go to the refrigerator, he's right there going, "What you got for me, Dad?" Stupid puppy dog eyes. And I'm a big softy when it comes to him, so I have to tell myself, "You got to." It's unhealthy for him to be overweight, just like me. Did I forget the bedroll? I picked it up. I picked it up. You scared me. I just realized, hang tight. Something's walking around here. I hear it, but I don't see it. It's a deer. He must be on the other side of that, this berm right here. Come on, man. There it is. I'm going to put this away.
All right, I'm going to go ahead and uh, chow on some cattails, I think. Just a few. All right. The reason that I, I were going to Thompson's, guys, if you just coming in, it, it, rather than go straight to the airfield, is we, um, there's that deer. I knew I heard that deer. Um, there's some stems here that are available that I, I want to go get. Because I really can't pass up three stems now that I know where they're at. The question is, I wonder if you, if you can, um, find the stems without finding the note. Can you do that? I don't even know. Hey, what's up, uh, Pokemon Pidgey Cards? Well, we're going to spend the night here at, at the crossing. Now, we haven't been here again yet, have we? I don't think we have. I don't think I've ever come up this angle either. Heck. I could have sworn I saw the buildings. I just don't see them now. I think we're almost there. Here we go. It's over here. I think. What is that? Well, that's the church. Okay, cool. The steeple above that rock. Do I have a uh, do I have to buy the DLC to get a chance at uh, getting Vaughn's rifle or the Curator's rifle? I don't know to tell you the truth, Blueberry. I to be honest, I don't know. Um, I know they're putting some stuff in the game if you don't buy the DLC, but I don't know how much or how little they're putting in. It's worth it though. I think it's worth it. You know, I don't know if I took that note. Did I take that note? I guess we're going to find out. Those are in the free update? Cool. All right. This is where the uh, with the snare, with the, uh, the snares. There we go. Oh, loose boards underneath. Here we go. Stem, 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 painkillers. So you get three stems and a painkiller. That seems pretty standard right now, which is cool. I don't know why I thought that was rifle ammunition. That would have been weird to have rifle ammunition in a in a uh, in a church, huh? I mean, I guess not after the apocalypse, you know? Apocalypse, apocalypse. I saw you. You didn't think I did, but I did. That deer was playing Galaga. <laughs> Stupid. <laughs> it's an Avengers joke. Uh, what do we got in here? Anything? Nothing, nothing. Nothing, nothing. Cloth. Uh, I am exhausted. No batteries. I don't think we have any batteries, guys. I don't think I'm, I'm going to be able to make new ammo. All I need to see is one proof of concept uh, battery, and I will be a happy man, but I don't think it's going to happen.
You guys asked me to do gun loper. Has anyone ever done gun loper, gun loper and found, found batteries? In gun loper, mind you, is what I am talking about. Ooh, a 75% tin of sardines, baby. I'm excited. Not really, but... Can't wait till I get to Milton. Uh, not going to Milton. We're going to the airfield. I came for these stems, and that's pretty much it. I am going to search all these houses, though. We're going to spend a day here. But I'm going to keep going until we hit the airfield, so... Yeah, Blueberry, if you want to go over on my Discord, um, somebody will help you out over there. Because I got good people in my community. Very helpful. No batteries in the cars. That means bullets we have, guys. That's all we have. That's it. So... Yeah, I don't think, I don't think they exist, man. Because you're starting off with, with interloper settings, which had which there's no reason to have batteries if you don't have guns. Well, well should or shouldn't, I don't think I don't think they're in there. I'll keep looking, but I don't think they're there. I really hope I'm wrong. You found ba batteries in gun loper? Alright, that's cool. But it's Xbox, you know, if it makes a difference. It shouldn't, because it should be, it should be the same, no matter what. Matches, do we have matches? Alright, I gotta, get, I gotta eat soon, light some more of these. I'm gonna eat all this nasty food. And we're going to get sick. Can you add batteries after the fact? No. I'm talking about car batteries. Better right there. You turn them down for lead for your for your bullets. We went there. Yeah, car batteries don't spawn in interloper mode. I didn't think they did. So I was correct. So somebody said that they, they, they found him in, in gun loper. Who said that? Video game logic and developer lo logic sometimes don't, uh, you did, Sam? Sometimes, uh, oh, that's cool. I'm gonna get full, but I'm, I'm low on health, so I don't know if I want to eat all this food right now or not. Because if I get sick, and I will get sick, I won't gain any health back in 10 hours. But you know what, that's fine. That's okay. I don't want to lose my bonus. 
So my bonus is more important than, than getting sick or getting that getting ten percent of my health back. I want that carry weight. So we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna have a little uh No, oh, I have food. It's nasty. It's nasty. Uh, Alright, let's do that then. I've got water in this toilet back here, so let's go ahead and um, I'm going to eat. Uh, I'm going to save the soda because the soda won't make me sick. Uh, these nasty peaches. Millions of peaches. They could kill me. Mil million, er, these rotten peaches. Just wait and see. Uh, what? Zero percent didn't make me sick. Oh. Oh, two for two. Oh. There it is. May as well make it a party. Let's have some sardines. Woo! I'm too full to eat. Oh. All right. Let's go ahead and uh, drink our water. Suck down some antibiotics. Sleep for 10 hours. Cook what? My peaches? It won't make a difference. Doesn't make a damn bit of difference with those cans. We healed our food poisoning. It's almost done. It's uh Well I can sleep for two more hours, that's cool. But I mean, come on, guys. I played in a loper long enough. You know, I don't need. I don't need. I don't need weapons. You guys are like gun loper, gun loper, gun loper. For like a year, you guys were like gun loper, gun loper, and I'm like, no. And then I did. Now I have, and I can't even make my own bullets. What's wrong with you people? <laughs> well, since we're gonna sit here for a minute. Let's go ahead and. Uh, Oh my god, that knife is 2%. You guys told me that. Oh, I can't do that. We cannot do that. Wait. Do I have a can opener? Yeah, I do. Okay. So it's not using my knife. So I, but making that jacket, making those two jackets killed my knife. I need a sharpener. For sure, for sure. All right. Let's actually go to the uh, the rec center. Ice fishing in real life? I've never been ice fishing in real life. That'd be kind of cool. We don't really uh, get... Well, I, I guess if I went... I don't know, 30, 30 40 miles in, in, a, in, a, in a direction... Too much stuff to carry. I might be able to um, to go ice fishing. But we get just enough snow to get snow on the ground and freeze some stuff. But I wouldn't trust the this lake that I that's or these lakes that where we're at. Do I have a mag lens yet? I don't think so. I'll get one though. Yeah, no, I don't have one. Or we'll ditch these. I don't need those. That'll come in handy. Picture's blurry. Anybody else having a problem? Maybe t uh, check your settings, yo. What's up, Mobux? How you doing, bud? How's it going? Hmm. 
Is anyone else having a, uh, a picture problem? If so, there's no reason for me to be live streaming, because if, if something's wrong, I, I'm not going to do it. I need to drop something. I need to drop something. What do you guys, what, I, 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 okay, I need, I need everybody in chat to listen to me right quick. Is the picture been blurry for you guys? No issue? Okay, Jennifer's got no issue. Check your settings, um, on YouTube and see if you can raise your resolution up. It's a little, little, um, wheel icon, a little gear icon. Okay, if you guys are, if, 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 if only a couple of you are noticing an issue. All right, all right, so it's... So long as the video goes up and it's in 1080p, that's what I care about. But that's, uh, that's on your end, guys. But thank you for telling me, because if something's wrong, I need to fix it. Welcome back, Gabby. And thank you, thank you everybody for answering me. I appreciate it. I could use this. Oh, my whetstone. I found a whetstone. Yeah, boy. All right. God, I'm a goofy bastard. All right. Um. That's exciting, though. All right, we're going to have to spend a little time here. But I think I want to do that after I go across the street. Well, Danny, to be fair, I've had crap equipment for most of my career on YouTube. I just now got um, myself up to sp up to date on like my audio and my and and my computer. So, so many of my early videos were garbage. I refuse to let that happen anymore. There's no reason for it. There's no excuse for it, except for the fact that I, my internet is not as fast as fiber. So, that's the only thing slowing me down right now. Um, like I can't even play an FPS game because until I get fiber because I can't be competitive um, No sense of me going playing PUBG or or any of those other or, or, or you know or COD or any of those Because I couldn't be competitive If I shoot a, a bullet and somebody else shoots a bullet if, if I shoot a bullet at somebody somebody else shoots a bullet at me at this exact same time They're gonna kill me and I'm not gonna kill them because my um, because of the uh, just that little bit of chat not, not chat like but a little bit of lag the ping is just not quite good enough I'm no no Starlink what about Starlink it's not fast enough either I don't care what Elon says I, I, I seriously thought about getting Starlink it's just not fast enough for, to compete no way even at his low Earth or orbit that he has his satellites in. I guarantee you 100% you will lose. Yeah, I'm wearing two wool socks. I'm pretty sure. It's fine for regular gaming, but Starlink would be fine for regular gaming. And if I was out in the middle of nowhere, it would be amazing. H1Z1, I used to, back in the day when it when it was uh, before they just like. I don't even know what happened, dude. It just. It was cool for what it was for at the time, but. Okay, I thought I saw some wolf tracks. Let's get back to the. Uh, to 
to the rec center. I want to fix my clothes. Wally, you're telling me you have you have Starlink, you play uh, Call of Duty, and you're at the top of the leaderboards on the regular. I find that very hard to believe, but okay. Maybe Elon's done something to speed it up. I don't know. Maybe there's enough satellites in the air now that it, that it makes a difference. But I was there. I was there. Got invited to the beta testing, and I, I just didn't want to spend 500 bucks for the uh, for the, the the system itself. So. Um, and then it's uh, and it's the same price as my internet a month. So, I mean, I'll take your word for it. If that's the case, if Elon's got enough satellites in the air now where it's, uh, it's got a low enough ping, then I might seriously think about doing that. Well, here, hang on a second. One second. Hang on. Just give me one second. I know you guys. By the way, if you're watching this and you're and you're wanting you're wanting to, um, want me to play the game, just bear with me one second here. I gotta I gotta do something. Um, all right, I'm running a speed test right quick. Uh, now I'm streaming too, mind you. So I've got fifty down. And I think it's 10 or 20 up is all. Yeah. So it's 50 down and 20 up is what I've got. Okay. So if you, can you do better than 50 down and 20 up? Come on. That's what I've got. 50 down, 20 up. It's not much. It's what I've been dealing with, man. It's the best in my town. Except for the fiber that's on the other side of the main street. Yeah, I'm hardwired. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, I don't. So you, you guys who have, who have, uh, who have fiber, man, you are, are close to it. You, you have 400 down and 60 up? Dude, I could do that. I need the I need the fiber hookup, but we don't have it. One twenty down and fifty up. Yeah, we don't have it available. That's what I'm trying to tell you guys. It's not available. <laughs> if it was, I'd have it. I'd spend I I would spend double the amount of my internet to uh, my internet bill every month. Can you check the trash cans outside? Well, I can, but I'm not gonna because it's cold right now. But remind me, uh, cop, uh, cop picking. Well, ping changes uh, changes depending on what game you're playing and where their servers are. So uh, that 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 that. Um, but it also depends on your internet speed too. Um, yeah, no, I'm I'm not. I do not have fast internet at all, and I've been after. The city, I, I, I've talked to the city manager a year and a half ago, two years ago, two year, a year and a half ago. And uh, he was like, yeah, we just got this infrastructure package from the government that's going to allow us to do roads and parks and Internet for everybody. And I'm like, OK, that's cool. And I'm still waiting on it. Half the town has it, half the town doesn't. I'm pissed. CenturyLink here sucks. It's worse than what I've got. I have a, a I have TDS, and it's the fastest internet in the area. I really can't do anything about it. Like I said, when I said my internet was not allowing me to become to be competitive in an FPS game, I mean I meant it. One computer's hardware can't handle speeds that high by itself? Nah. We're fine. Your horse. 
My Alienware computer has a 11th gen processor, so I think I could probably, I could probably uh, handle it. I need leather. I have leather in the form of these gloves. I need some water. I won't forget. All right. A gigabit built. You mean a computer? I don't understand what you mean by that. Yeah, uh, uh, Queen Alexia, um, we're you, you and I are, are, are have the same. We, we use the same company. Um. I've noticed that they like to, um, they like to, they like to do, um, maintenance work at the weirdest times. Actually, I don't need that. Drop that. And I don't need those, so drop those. All right, we just came for the stems, guys. I'm going to sleep the night here, and we're going to go, ooh, I almost lost my bonus. Hopefully, I hung out here long enough. Oh, no, I still don't have. I got a gallon of water. Let me drink this right quick. That shouldn't make me sick, I don't think. Never has before. Yeah. Let's eat these cattails, and then I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna make some um, some tea, I think. You pay 146 in internet and cable. I don't have I don't have cable TV. Um, but I pay 110 for my internet a month from TDS. Yeah, no, I don't have a I don't have a um, you know what you call it anymore. I mean, yet a, a, a glass. I don't have a glass yet. We need one. I'll find one. Once we get to the new map, we'll find it. 14.4K uh, uh, dial-up. Yeah, I remember those days, man. I don't need more than that. Let me... Do that. Let's do four. I'm gonna be hauling. I'm gonna be going going a ways. anything to cook so I guess we're not gonna cook don't have nothing can't cook nothing okay I need I want good torches though come on give me a good torch I'll burn down this church I swear to God Cool. All right, we'll drop the, uh, the the other garbage torches or the ones that are like not not that great. Um. Yeah, I got seventy three and three. Oh, uh, fifty four. And okay, we don't need these then. We'll drop that one, that one, that one, that one. And we'll keep those. That's good. All right, let's go ahead. 
So I have a few calories. I'm going to take a little time. We're going to go ahead and... Ooh, that's not doing great either. All right, we'll get the knife up to 50% and then we'll, and we'll alternate. All right, bear with me. Streaming TV is, is the end thing now? Yeah, yeah, yeah. If you know where to look, you can find almost anything you want on the online. Or just be careful what you or where you go so you don't catch a virus. I'm not advocating anything that's not legal. By the way, let's be perfectly clear. Um, John, we're going to stop by the farmhouse. You're 99% certain you spotted Maglins in the basement? Really? I missed it. That didn't surprise me, but okay. Well, Chad, I hope you feel better, man. The internet's just been a dump a dumpster fire today, though. Big time, Tw uh, Twitter especially. Oh, Elon's uh, put up a poll on Twitter. He's like, should I step down as CEO of Twitter? He said, I'll abide by your decision. It looks like he's probably going to step down. Because uh, Homeboy doesn't put up a poll just because, just because. Like, he's looking for a result that he wants to see. And he knows what to say. And he, I, I expect he wants out. <laughs> he started this. After uh, he got booed off stage for the Dave Chappelle show, he um, I think he realized it's time to let somebody else take the reins. He's got a bunch of other stuff going on, though, you know? All right, that's as good as we're going to get, guys. That is the end of that whetstone. So that is, and it is now, let's go ahead and slap this in here. Where is it? I'm going to eat the rest of my food. I, I, I really was hoping to get... Now, I wonder if I'm sick and I take an herbal tea if it'll if it'll heal me. I, I don't think I've ever tried that before. Well, let, let's eat all the garbage food. Make ourselves sick. See what that does. I've got plenty of water still. Didn't get sick, so that's cool. I'm going to drink a tea. Even though I don't really need to, we're going to do it anyway. Oh, no matter what you guys feel about Elon one way or the other, it's all about money. It's always about money. And expanding his footprint as much as he can. All right, I'm going to sleep eight hours, man. All right, we're back up to full health. I am at 93 out of 99 pounds. Yeah, I know. Because she's trans. 
And that's how, it, and her dad doesn't agree. What's in here? Nothing? Gets off the weight. I didn't want to, but I guess we're gonna have to. Um. Now he bu he bought um. Twitter on a on a on a lamb. He I mean like he he um. Somebody told him I'm sure some some one of his whoever he listens to told him that he could make money on Twitter if he bought it. And then they convinced the investors. And we're leaving. I guess I really don't have anything else going on here. Oh, it's foggy as hell, and we're going back inside. I am fully geared. That's why we're we're heading to the. Um, I got, I wanted to come here to get the stems. So, um, or, well, the church over there. So that's why we're we're still here in Thompson Crossing. It's only been an hour though, so that's not too bad. Uh, I guess I'll sleep for two hours, cause we're gonna we got a long way to go. But now that one of you had, had mentioned, no, who mentioned that mag lens? I have to go find go see if that mag lens is there. It's, it's delaying us, cause of it, cause, just cause I want to get the rest of the gear. Oh, we're good. What the hell noise was that? Let's go. Wait, did I? I already went in here, right? Yeah, I did. Well, one arrow down is not bad for the temp. That's good. I'm not going to go into that cave. We're not going to bother with it. In the hide storage? What hide storage? What is that? We're moving at a pretty good clip, which is great. Oh, the one behind that? No, I didn't. I didn't. Break. I'm not. I wasn't gonna break down that table and, and take the time. I know the one you're talking about, Kevin. Um, yeah, no. There's two folding tables that uh that are leaned up against a uh, a stash box over there at the rec center, and I didn't. I didn't break down. You got to break down the tables to get to them. The second one I opened. The one that you can get to. I didn't. But the one that's hidden, I didn't. I didn't bother. This is the interloper. There's not enough. There's not. There's not any gear. Oh, there's not as much gear here as there is on other playthroughs. So sometimes to save time, I don't. I'm not gonna even bother. I might lose my bonus too. We're gonna have to hunt. What's the end game goal? I mean, it depends on who you are or what you're doing. Um, for me, it's, uh, normally it's 500 days in a game. But yeah, you survive as long as possible. The story mode uh, is a little different. You're trying to get to a certain spot and find your ex-wife after the plane wreck. Yeah, I got my well-fed well bonus back. 
I want to keep it if I can. But I'm running out of food. No, no batteries, guys. So we only have the bullets we've got. That's all. So casings don't matter. On gunloper. Because it's interloper and there's no there's no firearms, so they don't they don't give us batteries. So what I've got is what I've got. So I need to start being more frugal with my with my uh, bullets and I need to start thinking about making a bow. Or at least bring in the stuff with me that I need to make a bow. Back at the cave, we've got some stuff. Back at the dam, we have some things. So we'll give that a try. Actually, I think I'm going to find everything I need at the, at the airfield. So I think we'll just go to the airfield. Screw it. I'll just go to the airfield and we'll wing it. <laughs> Warmth is the major, there was a major uh, uh, set, the setback at, at, the, uh, at that. Wait, what? Well, I've already been there, I think. Um, you're making me want to go to the, 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 to the, uh, the homestead, though. So you said you 90, you're ninety nine percent sure that you saw a maglins in the basement in my playthrough, this playthrough. I'm gonna go check. I hope you're right. You remember where you saw it? Cattails, baby. They don't even give you primers. Yeah, well, you know. That's just one more thing for them to add if they if they had to. Video game logic. Okay, where, John? Oh, did I get the backpack? Slade asked, did I get, get the backpack? Yes. All right. It's not luck, it's skill. You've been lucky so far with viewers pointing out stuff. Nope. I've got good people. It's not luck. They are skillful. Also, you guys have the opportunity of seeing and not talking. I mean, you type, but you know what I mean? Where is it? Where you find the matches. Negative. I don't see it. It used to be you could find it in there sometimes. There it is right there, boy. Look at that noise. Woo! 94% doesn't matter. You never lose durability with that thing, so it doesn't really matter, but that's cool. Hey, gold star for the day. John, gold star for the day, buddy. That's awesome. Thank you. All right, let's go ahead and head. Very cool. Good eye. I don't know how you saw that. Totally worth me coming back. That'll be a big help down the road. Also, I've got people that go, I mean, on their own. I don't ask them to. And they go and they scrub those videos and they look they look for things. So, and I don't go back and scrub my videos. 
If there's an issue, I'll go, but. What time is it? It's midday. I was going to stop for rabbits, but I don't think I'm going to. I'm going to keep going. You found one there on your playthrough? Oh, okay. I don't, is it in, in that exact same spot? I wonder if that's a guaranteed spot. So now that we are done with our our, um, our walkabout, let's head back to the cave and grab all the essentials. Hopefully I have enough deer hides to do something. And then we'll head out to the uh, airfield. We'll be probably, this is probably a three or four hour live stream because I'm already an hour 15 in, or an hour in. Mobox, darn! I barely saw it uh, when you when you picked it up. Nice, nice job, John. Yeah, no doubt. Thank you for that super chat. Appreciate that. I do appreciate it. Yeah, it makes a big difference what difficulty you're on. Like somebody could tell me, well, I found this here. Number one. What difficulty are you on? And two, you realize that there are four loot tables. At least there used to be four loot tables. There might be more, more or less now. It might just be completely random. There might not even be a loot table anymore. But I think they have, it kind of has to be in their coding. Unless it's just gone random. Like you have a, the X percent chance of getting this thing. Or X percent chance of getting that thing. I'm not going to go through and figure it all out, but um, I'm sure somebody will. All right. I'm going to get up top. Are there not rabbits on the way to the cave? Yes, there are. Um, but I'm not going to worry about it too much. I have some food on me. Oh, I don't have much, do I? Hmm. I've got six cattails. That's fine. That's enough. With what I've got on me, we can make it back to the cave. And I've got food at the cave, I think. But if I carry a rabbit, it makes me smell. If I have to stop and cook a rabbit, it, um, it takes time. Because i got to skin the rabbit and start the fire and cook him. And I want to get us to the airfield. I mean, if I have to drop 10 pounds of, of material, we'll drop 10 pounds of material. If I lose my bonus. But we're right here at the... Uh, at the fishing uh, hut, so I might do that. I might stop. We got cattails here, though. Never mind. I'll just snatch these cattails and we'll take off. We'll check that fishing hut, though. Any future DLCs will oh, connect Mountain Town or, or oh, to Mountain Town or Hush River? I was like, Mountain Town and Hush River Valley, they, they connect. What are you talking about? But I misread what you said. Um, oh, I mean, I imagine. I mean, they have the, 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 the entire map of the island. And I think their, entire, their, their, their uh, game plan all along was to fill out the entire, the entire island. Over the course of probably like, a, they probably had a 20, 20 year game plan. That's what I'm thinking. And they knew before they, before they 
started what they what they wanted to do, but it took them to this point to be able to put anything in. We'll get a we'll get, we'll get a chunk every single year for the next five or ten years probably. And rifle cartridges, baby. Bullets are bullets. I'll take them all. Okay. Um, let me eat a few of these guys. We're having sardines and chips for dinner. For sure, for sure. Okay, 93 pounds out of 99. Get out of here. I missed that cattail. Hey, Oz. Pee on it. Hey, crackers. What's up, dude? New salty crackers. Whoop, whoop. I saved the day. Very nice. All right, I'm going this way. No, Amy, I am not. <laughs> Well, it's that time of year where all kinds of weird ads are coming out. It's Christmas time. Is there a deer underneath me? No. This is a long trek to be sure, to be sure. There might be a bear here too. All right, unless he's behind those rocks, I might be clear. It does come from that direction, though. Uh, I don't remember. Can I get this way? Can we, I think we can get this way, right? Do I have any f uh, favorite Christmas movie? Um, no, but happy Hanukkah, everybody. Uh, if you celebrate that, um, Hanukkah just started today, and I didn't say anything in Discord, but if you are, if you do, happy Hanukkah. Oh, look at my water. And I have food. Oh, we're taking this. I might eat this tonight before I go to bed. Nasty sardines. I got all this water. Look at that, man. Good stuff. Good stuff.
Hey, I forgot I had this hide, man. Cool. I looked in you. Yep, yep. Um, as far as a favorite Christmas movie goes, Die Hard. Rest in peace, Alan Rickman. You were a great Snape. I don't know. I always liked Home Alone. That's a pretty good uh, Christmas movie. With George C. Scott. By the way, Die Hard was a jet was a joke. I thought I had a fire here. Did I not have a fire here? I guess not. Okay, I'm gonna have to think about making some. Uh... Actually, I've got cattails. We're fine. We're fine. Let's eat some cattails. That'll carry me to the dam. Die Hard is a Christmas movie. <laughs> it's set in Christmas. Fine, Spider-Man then. The new Spider-Man. Wonderful life. Okay, Clarence. <laughs> All right. I'm overburdened by two pounds. That should be fine. I'm almost full of food again. Eat all my cattails. Like a good little boy. It's always the that's always the, the the joke, man. Is like Die Hard is a Christmas movie. I'll fight you over it. <laughs> it's funny. All right. Slow and steady, guys. Slow and steady right now because I save my energy in case I gotta run. I want to save my ammo for uh, getting set up in the new area. It's a you know it's funny I, I see these uh, these tabloid articles in the you know, on, online about actors and the things that they're doing in their lives you know paparazzi does do, does their job or whatever um and it, it's funny to me to see how much they work when things happen in your like 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 macaulay culkin just had a kid not too long ago right and then i started seeing him in things because dude needs money <laughs> and or like bruce willis right before speaking of Die Hard, right before he um he told people he was going to quit acting because he had that he has that neurological disease or whatever it is um where he can't rem he can't really remember lines anymore he uh he worked he put like 30 movies out in like two years i don't know if it was that many but it seemed like a lot his face is everywhere and he took every job he could get like he didn't care how how uh, garbage the uh the script was or anything. I mean, I've, I've watched him in some really trash movies recently. And, um, because he needed the money.
You didn't know cattails were edible until you Googled uh, while watching yesterday? Oh, yeah, totally. Yeah, they're, they're, matter of fact, almost, now not the whole plant, but a lot of that plant is edible. Uh, the pollen can be used in, um, in, in cooking. The, um, the roots, although I would not suggest eating the roots, but you can. They, they, they can be used as a flower. The uh, center center of the stalk of it of the of the plant is uh, tastes like water chestnuts and, and almonds. More like water chestnuts than almonds, really. But I wouldn't recommend eating the roots, um, even though yeah, they are edible, and they are probably pretty healthy. That's a it's a swamp plant or it's a wetland plant, so it, that, the roots filter out a bunch or all that crappy water. Once it gets into the stalk, it's probably not too bad. But um, yeah, I wouldn't I wouldn't I mean eat the roots unless I had to, or unless it was in a place where I, where there wasn't any human activity. Are they supposed to be related to asparagus? I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, his parents did take all, a lot of his money. He was a kid. That's what happens. I, mean, I don't even know. I don't. It, 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 it might have been. Late enough, he got residuals off a of home loan, but I don't think so. I think they just paid him. He should have, because, I mean, he is he is the face of home alone. He and Joe Pesci. Spargages? <laughs> right, I've already searched all this, so we're just going to leave. Caps? What caps? Oh, CG? Yeah. And you did it again. <laughs> That's funny. Yeah. Like TG was saying, I mean, pretty much at any type of any time of the year, a part of the cattail is going to be edible, one way or another. I'll make a video of it. I'll mess around with it a little bit down the road. When I uh when I put that homestead channel up. That homestead channel's probably not gonna go up until I don't know, April. Probably April. I got a lot of stuff I gotta get done. And I need to see how many games are coming out how fast because I can't do I'm one, I'm one man. I can only do so much. So if I have to if I have to delay this homestead channel for the games that are coming out next year, I'm gonna. But I expect because I can start planting at the end of May. So I expect that in April I can show you my starts and I can I can start that up. We'll get one video as an intro to the homestead channel. Because I'm gonna, because I, over the last few years, I've got a bunch of stuff that I gotta put down on my taxes. So, all right, that's potable. That's potable. Um, all right, let's take a look here. See what I'm gonna take with me. I mean, I've got these ten arrowheads. I may as well yank. Put well, yeah, we'll pull those. That's fine. We're gonna have to reevaluate what we're doing here because it's too much weight. But I don't expect to come back anytime soon. 
if at all. So, let's see. I should have another hide. We can make our boots. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Okay, I'm going to assume that we will not be able to make uh, more ammo. So, we're going to put this stuff away. I'm not going to throw them away because I need them. I mean, if I if if we can, I want to use them, but I don't think we're going to... Let's go... Ch I got to go check to see if we... Uh, let me drop these hides. We're going to stay here tonight, I think. But I got to go back to the cave and check out what I've got. I think I've got a, a couple of hides. Yeah, I'm going to drop a bunch of stuff, Mobux. Dandelion greens to you taste like mustard greens? They're bitter to me, but I don't mind the bitterness. Um, matter of fact, it, it our front yard, um, it was explained to me in very... In no uncertain terms, that I could have the uh, the side yard and the backyard to do whatever the hell I wanted with, but the front yard was had to be uh, had to be lawn. So I'm like, okay. So I turned that lawn into a dandelion field. <laughs> Every time I'm out there and they get the fluffy uh, tops, I'm like, <laughs> make more babies. Because dandelion is is one of those plants where it is every part of that plant is edible. Every part. Um, although I don't think I would like the stock. But I'm going to be gathering dandelion heads in the spring um, for making dandelion tea. Uh, the leaves are super, super healthy for you. They're like top of the list. When they when you look at your, the, uh, the nutritional benchmark on a plant, like dandelion is at top of the list. And then the roots can be used as a substitute for coffee. But it's like there's no substitute for coffee. Holy mackerel, Florian. Florian. Florian Lazar. Appreciate you, buddy. By the way, is Florian a, uh, a guy's name or a girl's name? Thank you for that super chat. Appreciate it. I meant to ask you before. It doesn't matter to me. You don't even have to identify it if you don't want. That's fine. I don't even care. I'm just curious. It's none of my business. Well, I don't have any hides, man. Shoot. Ooh. Take those, though. You're a dude. Okay, Florin. That's cool. Romania, huh? You getting up close and personal? With the nasty nasty over there on that side of the planet? Well, I guess I'm going to leave those hides here because I'm not going to haul them all the way to the, to the airfield. So we're going to deal with what we have. We, uh, we treat dandelions as a noxious weed to get rid of it as soon as possible. Yeah, no, it's 100%. 100% people, they, 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 they like, this is a weed, get rid of it. Because it doesn't, you know, match their perfect little lawn. And that's totally understandable if they want to do, they want to mess with it, but. Uh, Mullen. M-U-L-L-E-N. I know you, you misspelled it, but I know exactly what you're talking about, Danny. Uh, matter of fact, um, I there was a guy who was growing mullein here, and I was like, "Where do I find that wild?" And he's like, "I can't." It, he's like, "I grew it from seed, and I don't know that it's, it grows wild here." And I was like, "Nah, it grows wild here. I'm sure it is. It's an expectorant. It um, it it, it, it it'll clear out your lungs. Super good for you." 
Hello, box. Stop. There are beautiful people everywhere. Why you gotta be so... Why you gotta be like that, man? Oh, yeah, you can, yeah, totally. All depends on where you're at. Um, trying to remember the plant that I just learned about this year that I never even knew existed. Um, oh, what is it called? Oh, man, it's killing me. It's got a lemon flavor to it. And it and it's actually it's got protein in it, so you could actually help with your diet with protein if you need protein from this plant. I can't remember the damn name of it. You know, I don't have plantain here. I mean, I think I do, but I don't know. I I, I have to remember how what it looks like because um. I'm going to be doing some a lot of foraging. But that's going to be later. All right, what do I want to do here? We got to get out of here, man. Got to get out of this place. So All right. My hacksaw needs to be fixed. Let's do that. I've got a piece of scrap metal on me right now. Let's do that. Where are you? I was like, where'd my hacksaw go? Okay, uh... We might stay here for a couple nights. Um... Let's crash out, and then I'll, I'll, I'll deal with this in the morning. I don't want to get shocked. All right, food-wise, we've got... I'm going to eat the better foods. Save the cattails. If I can get down to 88 pounds, I'm not going to worry about my, my bonus. No, it's not lemon verbena. I can't do. Oh man, come on. It's a, it's a, it's a, it's like a ground cover, ish. I'll remember it. I, I'll wake up three o'clock in the morning or four o'clock in the morning, and I'll remember what it's called. Zippity zap. That's what I didn't want to happen. I mean, it's fine. We're, we're safe here, but um, I didn't want to be walking around when that happened. Purse Lane. It's called Purse Lane. It's my new favorite weed. Purse Lane. Look it up. It's delicious. I ate that all summer last summer. Raw. That was so good. And people were like, and when I told my mom about it, she was like, oh, yeah. She's like, we, 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 I, I personally ain't everywhere. It's nasty. I'm like, that's not nasty. It's yummy. I will be eating personally all next year. I transplanted it into my, into my garden. Never heard of it? Oh, yeah. Good stuff. Got protein in it. Really good stuff, man. One of the local farmers. Uh, you've died here from electrocution a few times. Yeah, that's why this front office is safe. Even with those wires there, there's no there's no sparks there. 
But you get over over there, yeah, you gotta watch it. All right, so let's go ahead and uh, guess I can use this to. Oh, you need to fix. I don't think I need to fix. Oh wait, I can fix these. I'm gonna put these away. Maybe. And every bit of that plant's edible, yeah. This is a gram per cup. Why you gotta spoil my? Why you gotta spoil my? Uh, my party, huh? My purse lane party. <laughs> oh man, I really want to take these saplings with me, but I'm not gonna. We've got enough bullets to last for a minute. Well, if it was the best part of the dam, are you crazy? <laughs> Personally, in Dandelion, cattails, that'd make a good salad. Sure will. I want to get my herbal garden going. I just hope that my berry bushes uh, um, that I planted last year survive the winter. I've got a blackberry bush that I would love to ha have it take. I babied those things all summer long. I have a blackberry and a couple of raspberry bushes, and I haven't watered them since fall, so I'm hoping that they're going to come back in the spring. Well, Fluffy just wants love. Yep. Well. All right, guys. We got to get serious about putting away some stuff here. Um, I'm not going to take these arrowheads. We'll make them when we get where we're going. It's too much weight. Uh, I'm going to drop one of those books. We're going to keep one for um, for backup. These hides can go. And I'll do the, uh, the guts can go, too. Um, I'll keep one of my repair kits how much antiseptic do I have all right let's go ahead and make I'm gonna ditch that we're gonna make two antiseptics from the old man's beard that's all I need really Um, how much birch bark? I can only make one birch bark. That's fine. Let's see here. Let's go back to what we're doing. Keep the teas. Keep all my bullets. I still haven't found a red uh, toolbox, which is really weird. And I haven't found another thermal underwear. I'm hoping we're going to find some. Uh, let's go ahead and let's drop. Let's go down to. Those. Wait, did I try? I didn't sharpen my knife, did I? I did. Okay, so they're both 100%. So I'm going to ditch. Two 
two of those, maybe three of those. Because I'm gonna be, there's gonna be a forge. I can go ahead and forge new stuff, so I don't care. We're definitely gonna get rid of some of that or most of that water. So let's go ahead. Let's drink our fill, and we're dropping the rest of the water. And that's gonna get me down to eight, below 88 pounds. So if I lose my bonus, we're gonna be fine. Actually, I don't need to drop all my water. We're gonna grab. We're, we'll take a half gallon with us. And that leaves me at 84.48, which is exactly where I need to be. Because if I lose my bonus, I want to be able to move still. So I think that's good. I think that's where we're going to stay. Um, I'm keeping these rose hips because I'm, I'm going to want to make some uh, some painkillers. Let's grab a stick. A couple of firewood. And now I'm just a little over. That's fine. We can go. Let's get out of here. Time to hit the uh, time to hit the airfield, guys. Let's go. Let's go. I pulled all my mint plants in. Um, I had them in pots, and so I've got. In the other room, I've got underneath an LED light, I've got um, apple mint, peppermint, spearmint. Um, I've got basil. I've got um, camphor basil as well. There's the moose. There's the moose. There's the moose. Do, 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 do. I'm not going to kill him. Good to know he's here, though. I knew I saw the moose sign. I knew he'd appear eventually, but... No, I don't need a hammer because I think there's a hammer there persistently at the at the um, at the forge. I know I said that I can't I can't make bullets, but picking up a shell case is, is a good habit to get to keep yourself into. Keep yourself into that didn't make sense. All right, so we're gonna warm up at the uh, at the office when we get there bunch of short little jaunts here guys yeah they can stay in the ground I just didn't have them in the ground I didn't want them taking over that's the thing and if it's so long as you you uh, you harvest it for as long as you cut it down before it flowers you should be fine which I don't really care if it takes over. I mean, because I, I, I'll drink mint tea every day of the year. I love me some mint tea, man. Ah, shit! Damn it. Thank you, Mobucks. I was wondering why I was so light. We got to go back. I have to go back. I need my bedroll. I'm not going anywhere without my bedroll. Ah, I forgot it. Thank you, Mobucks. Before I went all the way across the map and realized it, I would have been pissed off at myself. We have to go back. What a pain in the ass. Sitting here talking about... Um, about herbs and, and uh, wild plants and completely forgot. Well, it's really cold anyway, so I forgot my bedroom. Yeah, I did. My water bed. I forgot my water bed. Oh well, it happens. I'm just glad that somebody noticed. Did I make a bare bed roll? No. That takes two hides. We will make a bare bed roll. I will, I will. Once we get to the airfield. You thought I had an extra, uh, what, hide or bedroll? 
No, I don't have a backup. I don't have a backup. There we go. You would have kept your good clothes on. What do you mean? Hey, Grant. How you doing? I have my pot, though, right? Okay. You know what? I'm, I'm going to warm up. We're going we're gonna to take a nap for a couple hours. It's not even noon yet. Let's sleep for two hours, and then we'll, and we'll head out. Maybe this storm will pass. Let's, um, I should probably fix that bedroll too. Let's see for two hours. Lie strip, what's going on? Okay. Oh, Amy, did you invite him in? Sounds like the beginning of a movie. A new rom-com coming out this fall, or this spring. Amy and Daniel. I'm teasing. Don't be mad. Don't be silly like you and let your bedroll get ruined. Yeah, no, it's a 73% right now. Maybe probably 71% now. But um, it's fine. I would have been. It would have if I if I'd been a tad more prepared. <laughs> That's awesome. Well, you know what? Now that you know, I tell you what though. Um, I thought about getting uh, when I get my my e bike doing doing. Uh, this town is small enough that I could do DoorDash on a bike, and I thought about that too. Because they've got, every it seems like every time I turn around, and every time I stop into a store, somebody's pick or well, like you know, like a fast food joint, somebody's picking up a DoorDash. DoorDash love. Twenty twenty three. Well, we're just teasing, but seriously, I mean, hey, if you're available and he's available, why not? He used to be your manager at the store. DoorDash is good money, and so is, I mean, so is Uber. If you can if you can get into a into a a city that's big enough, that is. Here where I'm at, the competition is pretty steep, from what I understand. I talk to the DoorDashers all the time. Really, if you can get in with the company, man, you uh. There's not a whole lot. I mean, they got to do a background check, but they don't want you know. A weirdo. Well, an illegal weirdo dropping food off at strangers' houses. Hey, did you order some Kentucky Fried Chicken? Because I like chicken. I promise I don't have a chicken problem, but, you know. Can I come in for dinner? Ha ha ha! He was making fourteen fifty to be assistant manager. Holy, ma where do you live? That your assistant managers are making that little. We're, that's our minimum wage almost. 
in Colorado. Oh, a work reference. Where are those quotation marks? I offered to be a work reference for him. You'll be the plumber then? Rabbits. I mean, you, Rabbits, you're already the tattoo artist. What the hell? <laughs> I'm going to be ordering so much DoorDash now. Did someone order a pizza? That's exactly what I was saying, Jennifer. But that, And, you know, I mean, no, really seriously, though. Um, don't go to bars to meet people. Just order DoorDash. That should be their tagline. Montana. Yeah, 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 yeah. You can make $15 an hour, whoopee. Oh, is that what your minimum wage is? $15 an hour? That's actually higher than here. I'm really good in crawl spaces. Shut up, dude. That's just weird. <laughs> it's a new Hallmark movie. That's what it is. It's a Hallmark movie. Let's not get this twisted, guys. Come on, let's not be crass. Yeah, I thought you guys knew uh, Rabbits was a tattoo artist. Not just a tattoo artist, but he's just he's an artist. Um, shoot, I'm gonna lose my bonus. I think. Um, minimum wage is still super low. Yeah, that sucks, man. You know. I use the Colorado minimum wage as a benchmark for what I make on the channel. And uh, then I went and I, got, I started feeling every time I feel bad, um, I go and I, 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 I type in what is the national average minimum wage. And I feel a little bit better. Not much, but a little bit. And I feel bad. Then I feel bad for everybody who has to work for the, those, those crap wages. You can't survive on that stuff. Well, I mean, it's a it's a cost of living thing, though. Like immediately, as soon as the minimum wage went up here, everything else just went through the roof. Not 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 immediately, but within a couple of years, they were raising it by a dollar every year for like five years. Um. So. The quality of life here went up for a year or two and then it, and then all the businesses caught up and raised all their prices so now everything's like super expensive like i've seen it and, and also we have we, you know the inflation we've got going on right now i've got i've seen an increase of 30 percent in like everything still 725 dan oh my god how I don't know how people can survive on that anymore. Actually, I do. I do because you know what? For the, I mean, I've been doing YouTube for seven years, almost eight, but I took a year off, um, which basically resets you. And like, like, I'm only just this year and last year seeing Colorado minimum wage wages and that's assuming that i work 40 hours a week which i work way more than that because of uh the games i play and my and and, and researching games and all that other shit and all that social media crap um which i don't do a ton of but yeah it's only been the last couple of years that i can i've made any money really Extra 919? Oh, that's for 30 extra large. Uh, let's see, I buy the 18 pack usually when I buy it uh, I try, uh, for large, and it runs me about five, six bucks. So that sounds about right. That's the best price. That's at Costco, too. Wow. 411. I know, man. What is up with the, these eggs? Oh, I, I know what it is. We had that bird flu. Then the bird flu killed uh, uh, like millions and millions of birds. So we lost turkeys and chickens this year. That's why your eggs are, are going through the roof. 
But that's the price that we were paying at the farmer's market. Which is what makes me want to get chickens this next year. Because if, um, if, if, if I'm going through a dozen eggs every, I want to say, like every two weeks to a month, right? I go through a dozen eggs. But if I had a chick, if I had chickens, I would be eating more eggs, and less of the other meats for protein. And egg eggs are just way better for you if you eat the whole thing. I don't know where they got into this whole. I mean, well, I do. There was a there was a uh, not uh, not mislabeled. I was what's the uh, it was it was just a bad study where they said that you should be eating egg whites, not egg yolks. But the egg yolks and the egg whites were together. To make and it's more healthy for you, so it helps your your uh, your HDL and your LDL uh, cholesterol. Both, like one goes up, but the other one goes up too. So the good cholesterol and the bad cholesterol go up together, but it's a it's like it's like a balancing act with the eggs, the yolks and the and the whites together. So like I will if I had eggs and I had and I was taking care of chickens every day, I would be eating eggs every day. 100%. Because I love me a good omelet, man. Or an over easy. Mm -mm -mm. Over easy and toast. Make my own bread. That'd be amazing. But what I'm going to have to do is I'm going to have to decide. I'm allowed six chickens. So I have to decide how many I want to start with. I'm probably only going to start with two. But I probably need to, and then like every year, get two more. And then rotate those chickens out. So by the third year, the first two are stopped laying. And then I harvest those two for feathers for my arrows. No, not really. <laughs> but. Oh, yeah, I scrambled. I mean, I don't. I, 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 there's nothing I don't love about an egg. You know? We got. Uh, I went and spent ten dollars on this little this little baby steamer. Um, where it holds like seven eggs. And you put a little water in the bottom, cover it up with a cap. Now I can do the same thing in my skillet if I want to, if I want to steam something. But this little thing plugs in. It buzzes when it's done. It 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 steams the eggs. You put a little hole in the top of the egg, and um. Give it about 20 minutes. Voila, you don't even set it and forget it. And uh, when it buzzes, you let it cool on your countertop. And the next thing you know, you've got it's really easy to clean up because it's just water. And I've got seven hard boiled eggs, man. Zeus won't chase the chickens. Well, he's going to be taught not to. It's just like anything else with a child, you have to teach them. I don't see the bear. And it's not cold. I'm gonna try to keep my bonus if I can, but um, that's a lot of energy. Oh, it's a lot. I don't have a rice cooker. I've got a hot pot, Instapot. But yes, you can, for sure. Rice cookers break too easy. We were burning through uh, rice cooker every six months. This uh, it's Instapots lasted us for it's that you no know, small pressure cooker. The um, the electric pressure cooker, it's an amazing tool. I have I have my top five, my top five appliances that every college student should own, or if you're a single person. That you should own. Um, I mean, obviously, there's a microwave. Microwaves are, I mean, you, 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 but with besides the microwave, because that would be an honorable mention. Everybody owns a microwave for the most part. I mean, not everybody. I know there's be people in here who'd be like, I don't own a microwave. Instapot is an, is top of my list. Electric skillet. Um, electric kettle for your water. Berkey water filter. 
Let's see what else is on my counter. Um, hang on, let me eat some cattails. Oh, two crock pots, a big one and a small one. Big one if you want to cook for the week, small one if you want to cook for the night. Like, I don't, look, I don't use my stovetop, period. Um, I use, because it's an electric stovetop. I will, I'll use an electric skillet, and um, which probably is six to one half dozen to the other when it comes to uh, electricity use. But those big, round electric burners on an electric stove, dude, they just, it's too much. I use my oven. And I use my uh, my electric skillet. That's it, pretty much. Yeah, I mean, if I had gas, Tracy, I'd be using cast iron pans. But I have an electric stove that came with the house, and I haven't replaced it. I have my rather's. I'd have gas. But the way things are looking, they're. they're I mean, they're. they're I, I I don't know why, but they're trying to. I mean, they. They. I mean, I know why. But, you know, some states are talking about phasing out gas. I don't know how they're going to do that when we're all using it for heat and we're all using it for, to cook on. There's the bear. Over there is a bear. I see you, you little bear. Cool. That saved me a little bit of heartache. Yeah, I get ragged on a little bit. Well, I don't get ragged on, but um, I don't like wasting food. Every time I fill that, like I, I took a seven and a half pound roast and made uh, and made um, made barbecue pork um, in my big crock pot, and then shredded it. Obviously, once it was done, and um, turned around and froze half of it, and the other half sitting in the fridge, and where it's in half of it's almost gone. So I mean, if I have my And so I prep. I basically prepped, uh, you know, protein for the for the week, and we eat the same thing until it's gone. Like in in this house, you eat what is cooked, so it doesn't go bad because nobody wants to, nobody in this house wants to see any food go to waste. When we want a little variety, we'll have a little variety. It's fine. There's a wolf right there. All right, it feels like it's gonna start. Start getting worse here this weather. Hey, Chizzy, what's up? An air fryer? I, you know, I thought about getting an air fryer. Because um, I, I don't know anything about an air fryer. And I'd like to try it to see how well they work. Because there's somebody in this house that uses a shit ton of oil. And they're not supposed to. Because they got a pacemaker. And... I'm trying to keep uh, them from clogging their shit up. Most of my food is just uh, like simple, like, like I, you know, I worked in restaurants for so long. I don't do fancy shit anymore. I mean, I can. I'm capable of doing it, but really, simple food is better for your body. Grow my, I mean, you know, I, I grow my own veggies. I mean, I don't grow all my own veggies, but I've got a freezer full of tomatoes and, and green beans and apples. My freezer is literally filled. With tomatoes, green beans, and apples, for the most part. And half a ham. Because <laughs> I bought the ham the other day. But, um... I'm not going to grow any... I, you know, I was like... I was At first I was like, I want to grow and see what I can get... What I can, what I can, what I can grow. And then, you know, it's like... We weren't eating stuff. And I'm like, okay, well, if I'm not going to eat it then why would I grow it? Don't grow anything you're not going to eat. So, I mean, like, I haven't grown carrots, and I haven't grown celery, and I haven't grown onions, but you know what? That's the three things that I use in all my soups, is mirepoix. If you guys know what mirepoix is, it's onions, two parts onions, one part carrot, one part celery. And that's what I use in my soups, always. Because I was classically French trained to cook. And I like the flavor. And garlic. Garlic, garlic, garlic. Um, 
But all that stuff is super cheap. And is it, uh, my, 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 my thought on that is, is it worth the cost of the water? Because I live in the high desert, and our water's not cheap. Is it worth the cost of the water to grow the veggies? And if it's not, then I gotta grow something that's worth my money. And just go buy the veggies. Your blackstone griddle? What's a blackstone griddle? Oh, outside. Yeah. Yeah, I've got a I've got a, a, a double burner uh, stock pot um, propane stove that's sitting in my it's a Coleman. It's one of the stand up ones, the heavy duty ones. I, had, I, I haven't used it, not since I bought it. Never felt so cold in my life. I keep getting told I need to get rid of it, but I'm not going to I'm not going to do that. I don't think I hit him. Let's go. Is paying for water a thing in the U.S.? Yes. 100%. You get a water bill, sewer bill, trash bill, and then all your, all your utilities. Like your, I mean, it, that's considered a utility. Um, yeah, I pay between 50 to $80 a month from, for water, depending on, depending on the summer and how much I use. I'm just going to use this gun to scare these guys until we get where we're going. I need to get warmed up, though. All right, let's drop down into the uh, maintenance shed, guys. We have not been there. I want to see what we can get. We might pick up some matches, maybe some food, definitely some water. I'm going to reload, though, because I, I, we, we might have, like, a handful of wolves here. Yeah, trash bill. It charges, um, like, 30 bucks a, a month to uh, come pick up our garbage. In a like a bin, like you see, you know, people. Uh, take out to the to the curb. Mine's back behind the house, but in the alley, but Freezing. yeah, totally. Keep mushrooms away from you. You can have them. Oh, I love mushrooms. Matter of fact, I'm going to grow mushrooms. I've got a tool shed. As soon as I clear it out and I and I make it proper, we're gonna we're gonna, I'm gonna we're gonna be doing lion's mane. Um, I'm probably gonna do reishi, um, oyster mushrooms. What else am I gonna do? Because I can buy a block uh, that's filled with mycelium um, and uh, and grow mushrooms in my in my shed. I'm gonna do it. And if I can be successful at it, not only will we eat them, but I'm going to sell them at the farmer's market. A lot of the stuff I'm doing, I'm going to be doing on the Homestead Channel is going to be geared up to, to, um, I don't care about that toque. It's going to be geared up for the farmer's market. You guys, I mean, I'll, I will eventually have a stall at the farmer's market. Yeah, I charge for garbage. Matches, baby! Whoop, whoop. Morels, morels are good. Chanterelles are nice. I'm only gonna. I'll start with a, just a couple of different mushrooms, ones that I know that will eat. But they're easy. To, they're easy to freaking. Um, if you have the right conditions, you. I mean, you. You. It's. They're really easy to grow. You're in Mexico, and that's all covered by the government. Yeah. Tip the 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 the. the, the the trash trailer worker well i mean yeah i mean you know if it's free and they're doing their job every single every single day for uh, you know for all year that's appropriate to tip those guys you know what man be a garbage person that's that's a shitty job they should get paid more than i mean they should get paid as well as teachers and teachers should get paid a lot more that's what i mean teachers and and, tra and garbage workers 
Should get paid way more than they do. No batteries, yo. I'm give I'm giving up on this whole uh, hope of being able to make make bullets because that's not it's not happening. I don't care about that. We have different gloves. We have rabbit gloves. Now, there's my quality tools, man. Finally. We can plop down this other guy. I don't need that anymore. Um, let's see here. Eat those. Yeah, I agree with Gabby. If you think you should tip a worker, if you if you wonder if you should, then you probably should. 100%. But Yeah, see that's the thing uh rab rabbits uh, is is that's I mean, I don't know how much I mean, I figured that they probably make 25 30 bucks an hour here. To win minimum wage is like I think it's like Maybe it's 12. I don't know. Maybe I said I said 15 earlier, but I don't think it is 15 yet. I don't know if could Google that. That'd be cool. What's Colorado's minimum wage? It's a city job. Yeah. Oh, he'll never do that, Jen. Jennifer, he'll never give away all his money. He's he's he still wants to go to Mars. But I'm I won't. You know, I, at first I was like, before I saw how he was treating his people, before I knew that, uh, I was like, I would love to go to Mars with Elon. But now that I see it, once he gets there, <laughs> I'm afraid he's going to turn it into a penal colony. <laughs> it's still 375 where you're at, Marble? God dang, man. That's, that, that's slave wages. Literally, slave wages. You can't live off that as a server. Believe me, I, I did for years and years. 213, I remember it was 213 an hour for a, a server. I got, mat, I got more ammo. That's cool. Matches. Another cup of herbal tea. We might have to spend the night here, guys, I think. There's got to be something useful in here. I don't think he'll go himself. I think he. I think he's gonna send people there. Can you imagine being told by your boss on another planet when you're on another planet that if you don't if you don't do get your job done, you're not gonna be able to come home? Uh, sardines. All right. So here, let me go ahead and light my lantern. You guys can't see anything. Oh, it's twelve fifty six an hour, and it goes up to thirteen sixty five, and that should be the end, Chizzy. Of um, thank you for that. That should be the end of um, of the the minimum wage uh, increase. I think that's what we voted on like five six years ago. What's not true? That's not true. That's not true. Well, it's like you know, I, I've said it before. Uh, my wife's got you know, muscular dystrophy, and and we were and I was we're looking at what they get make for disability, and not only can they only give they only give disability uh, people eight hundred bucks a month, but um, you can't have more than two thousand dollars in the bank. <laughs> you have to be impoverished to get disability, and then you can't live on that disability. It's uh, it's it is criminal criminal 
Like, my wife has worked in the same job for 14 years. And it's going to be to the point where one of these days, one of her, her, like her boss is going to be like, you can't do your job anymore. And um, that just scares the shit out of us because... She's a worker, hard worker, never missed a day. Well, that's no, not true. For medical reasons, she's missed a day. But. Hang on a second. Let me see. Let's go ahead and grit. Let's eat this. All right. This is going to make me sick. No, let's not do that. Let's not do that. Let's go ahead and let's have a drink and go to bed. Nine hours. That should be enough. 755 is half your rent. You pay fifteen hundred dollars a month in rent, iridescence. How how many bedrooms? Like how big is your family? You make twenty two fifty an hour, and you're struggling to make ends meet. This is what it's you. You know, the only reason I can do this is because we have literally, we literally don't do anything. We don't go anywhere. Our entertainment is online. That is it. Um, I, 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 I literally spend as little as I have to on everything. I need the exercise anyway, so hang on, I'm gonna do I wanna eat? I don't wanna eat. Oh, we're gonna wait. I'm gonna lose my bonus. But see, I saw this coming years ago. The uh the whole like raising of the of the prices and everything else, and that's why I, I was like, we got to get by a house. We got to get a cheap mortgage now. Eight fifty is your entire mortgage. I managed to negotiate five fifty, but I don't have a nice house. I have a really, really old, shitty house, but it's four walls and a roof, and a front, side, and backyard for the pup, and my garden. So yeah, I'm I'm okay with that. You know, so you got to realize, man, you don't need everything you think you need. That's the only reason I can do what I'm doing right now. And you guys, you guys are the reason that I can do stuff like this. And I appreciate you guys. So thank you. That was not me. Uh, like, that's done, not a pity party by any stretch of the imagination. I'm totally happy doing what I'm doing. But... People live outside of their means so often that they just, uh, you're never taught to, to, you know, to, to be frugal. Like, oh, what's this? Oh. What's the text? An old key to a lockbox in Broken Railroad. Where is it? Does anybody know where it is? Hey, you know what? Ain't nothing wrong with a food bank. They, let me let me let me explain something to you. If you need to get on, if you need to, if you need uh, food, never be ashamed of going to a food bank. Um, I've gone to food banks many times over the years. Although sometimes the food banks aren't run as well as they could, and they I, I don't know what the workers are thinking. They're like, uh, you know, they give you like a jar of peanut butter, um, uh, a, box, a can of sardines, and and a cabbage, and they explain like, here you go, oh, it should do you for the month. I'm like, no, 
It, it won't. California has some of the Northern California has some of the best food banks I've ever I've ever come across. Um, where you know the the produce and the and the bread from the bakeries and the in the uh, and the grocery stores um, are you know when it gets to be like day old bread or you know donuts or whatever and the maybe the produce isn't as good as as they thought they think they can sell it then they turn around and they um, they give it to the food banks and then there was there was one in Arcata California when I lived when I lived in Arcata that was amazing it was right next to Humboldt State University where my lady at the time was going to going to college well she no she wasn't when we when I went when I showed up but that's a long story um but yeah I used to go and that's how I ate when I was homeless is I'd go there every day and I would get vegetables and bread you're trying to avoid it no, don't. Suck up your pride. This is my opinion. You don't do what I say, but I mean, suck up your pride, and um, and just go. And if you feel bad about it, maybe you can ask them if you could volunteer for a day or you know every couple of weeks. That would make you feel better about it, because I'm sure they could use the help. I worked in a food kitchen. I was on probation, but I then and, and they were like. You got to do X amount of hours of community service. And I'm like, okay, what you got? And they gave me a bunch of different options. And I was like, oh, you got a, you have a, a soup kitchen? I'll do that because I cook. And so I, I worked in a, in a soup kitchen for six months. It was awesome. I ate better in that six months from working in the soup kitchen. <laughs> I mean, I, you know, it's it like, they're like, yeah, you got to do something for the community. Okay, sure. And then. I just taking home food every week, man. Not, not. I mean, not, not just taking it, but um, it was given. You know, if there was anything left over, or if they got something in, and they were like, "Hey, you know, you want a box of donuts or something?" And I'm like, "Yeah, sure." You want to take some of this soup home that you made? Yeah, sure. Or chili mac, because I, I used to make chili mac a lot for those guys, man. Those men and women. I'm gonna lose my bonus. Shit. Uh, uh, eat the candy bar. Oh, my well. Okay, we just lost our well-fed bonus. Let's go in here right quick. All right, we're leaving Broken Railroad, and we are here. Okay, now that I'm getting, am I getting warm, warmed up? I'm not getting warmed up. What the hell's going on? Uh oh. Ruh -ruh shaggy. This should be warm. I don't know why it's not. Well, this is interloper, so guys, we might be in trouble. I mean, I don't mean trouble, trouble, but I mean it. Yeah, Amy, you know what? I mean, you, yeah, it's greasy bad food, but it saves money. And, it, you know, I get it. I do. If, they, if they're going to chuck that, man, I, I mean, so much food in this country goes to waste. Probably in the world, really, in any 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 industrialized society, um, a lot of food's going to waste around the world, not just America. Because I mean, because we have these these food policies in place to keep people from getting sick. There are a lot of people won't even let you. Um, a lot of companies won't even let you take anything home because they're afraid that because it is expired, it will make you, or it might make you sick, and you might sue them. I worked at a at an Italian restaurant in Texas that, that if they caught you eating off, uh, you know, eating scraps or taking food home off of plates or whatever, which is kind of you know not not the greatest, but if you're if you're hungry and poor, do what you got to do. Um, but they would they would fire you. They'd write you up. And then you're on their shit list, and and, and then you then then they'd fire you. So there we go. Now we're warm. Holy mackerel! All right, let's turn put, turn this off for a second. I gotta I gotta see what I since I lost my bonus anyway. Let's go ahead and let's drop. Um, I gotta drop some poundage. I 
I don't think firewood's going to be an issue. I think we're going to go ahead and drop all those. Drop that one. Drop this one. Um, keeping that. Drop one of these books. And then I'm right there. I'm going to drop those. And then... I'm going to wear that. Crampons can stay. That'll do. It would be uh, totally appropriate to text Daniel and invite him for coffee to catch up. Yes. 100%, Amy. Do it. Yes. 100%. Did you think you had a moment there for a second? Who knows? You might have a girlfriend or a boyfriend. You don't know. But hey, you won't know unless you try. 100%. Do it. Do it. Do it now. Do it. Stop watching me. Go go text him. You went uh, 40 straight without without food a few times in your life? I've been there. I have. Okay, here's a story you guys talk about your lack of food and whatnot. When I was homeless in California, um, back in my um, late teens, early 20s, um, I think I told you, did I tell you the, the, how Rocky Horror Picture Show saved my life? Does, how many people know how Rocky Horror Picture Show? Um, anyway... If you know Rocky Horror Picture Show, you know they have props and then they throw things at the screen and whatever. Well, there's a scene where they where, where they throw rice. The 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 uh, the um the audience members throw rice at the screen, right? So they bring rice to the Rocky Horror Picture Show. Well, and it's at midnight and uh, and it goes until two in the morning or whatever, and uh, you know, it's you know it's it's a cult thing that they do in the movie theater. Well, I was walking down the street of Arcata, California, and I was hungry. I had a camp in the Redwoods. Cabin fever my ass. What do you mean I have cabin fever? That's dumb. That should not be a thing, man. Should not be a thing, man. Anyway, so I'm walking by the theater, the movie theater, and I see this open box of rice and I was I had not eaten in like two days um, and I was waiting for the food bank to open up and I found this box of rice and I swear to God man I went back to my camp and I cooked up a big pot of rice Rocky Horror Picture Show saved, I, I say it saved my life but really they didn't really save my life but <laughs> um I hadn't eaten in a minute. So that rice was some of the best rice I've ever eaten. Probably one of the reasons why I don't eat rice these days. Okay, so... I am overburdened. Because I don't have... the carry weight anymore. Alright, well we gotta get inside. Um, let's, um... Drink that. There we go. We're going to drop down. I could have gone the other way, but it's fine. Yeah, they do keep throwing pry bars at me. That's great. Couldn't find one for the life of me in the beginning. I'm not going to be able to sleep in here. But... I just want to see what's going to happen if I put those in there and go get warmed up and come back out. Will we have rabbits? I don't know. Let's find out. Mm. 
Now, is this considered... Nope. Cabin fever. I can't wait either. So, that's kind of shitty. Um, I can't eat any of my garbage food because if I do and I get sick and I got to sleep for 10 hours, I can't sleep for 10 hours. So, let's go ahead and let's hit this. To wake back up. Let's go back out here. I'm, I changed my mind on this rabbit thing here. Let's take these. I'll just keep on keeping on. You were able to grow potatoes this year? I wish I could grow potatoes. I've tried years, or a couple years in a row, and I can't find... For the life of me, I can't grow a damn potato to save my life. It's my favorite vegetable. But if I go to the store, I can buy a bag for like, you know, five bucks. So why would I want to grow something and waste all my water on that when I can buy it so cheap? Same with all the other vegetables that I'd like to eat. They're so cheap. I'm like, why should I? By the way, we're going to gather all the coal here, guys, so we can go ahead and make a fire outside so I can sleep outside. Um... I mean, it's all about saving money, right? And and I just I'm I'm not I'm not saving money by growing the vegetables that I like to eat. Because the water's so damn high here. It's almost like they're, you know, they're trying to keep the keep the little man down, man. What are we doing here? Big ass cave. Hole in the middle. Yeah, well, we're going to need to sleep outside, dude. So I need as much firewood as I can get my hands on. So. Stop complaining, Mackenzie. Yeah, with, uh, with, uh, oh, what's his name? Jason Bourne. Your guilty pleasure is sharp cheddar cheese? That's a staple in my house. 100%. If I was told I can't eat cheese anymore, like I said, I would dig a grave and bury a block of cheese and then give it a headstone. To commemorate the passing of me being able to eat cheese. I've eaten cheese since I was mm, four years old, five years old, daily almost, and I'm 52. I have strong bones. Is it legal for you to collect rainwater in your city? Um, I didn't think it was, but uh, somebody who lives in my town that is in this chat, well, she may not be in the chat right now, but um, she was saying it's legal for us to do rainwater for um, things so long as it hits the ground and goes back into the earth. Like, I can't use it for, I can't use it for um, toilets. I can't use it for showers or baths. And I can't use it for, like, you know, my sink or dishes or things like that. Because that goes down into the sewer. But if it's going directly back into the ground, I guess I can. So I'm going to be putting in a, I, I need to fix my, um, I need to fix my gutter system, and I got to buy an IBC tote, or I mean, an IBC tote, and, you know, like a, a couple of IBC, uh, uh, water collection things, and then some drainage pipes, and I should be able to water my lawn, I mean, my lawn, not my lawn, my, uh, my garden, if I can, that's amazing, because that would save me so much money in, 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 in water every year. Uh, because this is the desert, or this is the high desert where I live, and um, and they and and if you don't have water going back into the ground, um, yeah, it's not. I mean, it's it's a little bit about control and, and money, but I mean, it's everything's about money, but but it is also about con about conservation. So I get it, and if you lived here, you'd get it too. But the fact that I can use it for my garden is amazing. Yeah, as long as it's being repurposed, I think it's okay.
All right, Steely Chasm. I thought that was a big grizzly bear for some reason. I don't know why I thought that. Can I get... I don't know if I can get in this boxcar or not. I don't think I can. I think it's shut down, right? Yeah, this isn't open. I'm looking for a place to escape this cold. How about here? Would that help you? There's no barrel here, though, is there? No. Let's go. Colorado Springs, it's illegal. Yeah, it doesn't surprise me. I mean, that's it's uh, it's it's a thing. But I'm also of the mind that I'd rather ask for uh, forgiveness than permission. But I was told by somebody who works in the city, that's in the know, that I can do it for my garden, which is great. I just gotta, I, I just gotta afford the uh, the parts and pieces. That's most of my homestead channel is gonna be me, um, trying to afford the parts and pieces, <laughs> and then building the projects and letting you letting you watch me build it. You know. Raid Hopper's Rockfall, huh? Hoping there'd be something there. We're almost there, guys. We're getting there. I would love to live in a place where I, where I felt like I had unlimited water. My ideal is to, oops, is to um, own a piece of property with water on it. You can do so much with water. Literally power my house with water. I just get a Pelton wheel. So this, look at this, 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 uh, this blurry garbage that's on my screen. I thought we fixed this. It's got to be the new map. It has to be. You want to make a forge? YouTube is your friend. There's a couple of uh, guys that have done like uh, propane power to uh, for forges. Unless so you can get your hands on coal. Or you can make your own coal. Your own charcoal. Like my old man used to do. My father, we had a, we had a forge when I was growing up. My dad did some pretty good uh, wrought iron work. I'm not saying he was the best dad in the world, but he taught me a few things. Don't come to Texas. I lived in Texas for seven and a half years, Slade. What are you talking about? About what? what you, uh, maybe I missed something. It seems like I missed I missed some conversation there. All right, kids, we're losing our, we're losing, um, I gotta hurry. We're losing too much health. And I'm still in freaking, in cabin fever land. 
Okay. Come on, dude. Where's that cave at? It's back in here, right? Oh, slaves for water. Don't come to Texas for water. No, that's not true either. The hill country's nice, man. Kerrville has a, has a has a river running right through it. Are you kidding me? I don't know what part of Texas you're from, but... Um, yeah, if you're in the right part of Texas, man, you can have you can have all the water you want. Oh, it's open. It'll let me. Yeah, it'll let me, Becca. 100%. 100%. Guarantee. Ah, uh, guarantee. Why is there a mushroom growing out of that? What the hell's this? Rose hip? Rose hip? Rose hip? Cloth? Candy bar? What the hell's that all about? That's weird. All right, let's go. No batteries for lead. Nope. All right, so we're going up in temp. What do I have to eat that's not going to make me deathly ill? That I guess I'll eat that. That's cool. And I'm going to get rabbits because I'm going to need to get rabbits. As soon as we get warmed up, we're going to get rabbits. For sure, for sure. So let's go ahead and I guess we'll sleep for an hour. Save on calories. Get the voodoo. <laughs> All right. I'm going to get my rabbits. Oh. What do you mean you don't have any rocks? You got no stones, man. You got no stones. <laughs> Little bunny foo foo. Hopping through the forest. Waiting for usual to bop you on the head. Oh, is this a, is it a custom difficulty, Tristan? Yes, it's a, it, it's we start with the interloper settings, then we just add guns. It's under custom. 
you you you're, you go down and you can flip through whatever difficulty you want, and then you can add or subtract things if you want to. You can make your own custom game. the The code should be pinned in my uh, in my Discord. If you want to use the code, you can play the same same game I'm playing. All right, so that's two. At least they don't scream. They kind of do. That's a big rabbit, man. That's that's a big rabbit. That's a four and a half pound rabbit. Well, if you do it right, they don't scream. <laughs> All right, I don't care about those right now because once we get to a once we get to the the, the airfield map, then we'll uh, we'll start worrying about. Keeping hides and things like that. Okay, so we're going to have a rabbit. Yeah, it's in the afternoon, too. That's good. That'll be enough to get me through the night. And we got herbal tea. I hope that this cave is warm enough to keep me. Just until my cabin fever's gone. I've got 19 more hours. That's, yeah, it's still brand new. Thanks, Nightmare. Now, I'm not going to eat until I go to bed, so... I don't have enough water. I got to make water. Hang on. Make water so I can make tea. There we go. Do I have another one? I only have the one. That's fine. Let's go ahead and slap on one more. I'm going to do the cedar firewood. And I'll give me one more batch of water. Cool. All right, guys. 104 degrees. Yep, it's warm here. You making fries in an air fryer? Mmm. Water ship down, Banicula. They were, they were, these were, these were vampire rabbits, man. You don't, you don't even know. Oh, Banicula. Oh, look. We have Banicula and the Velveteen Rabbit right next to each other. I'm gonna make somebody cry. Watch. I'm gonna make somebody cry. Alright, so that's going to be good. I'm going to pick this up. I hope I'm going to let this burn out. I, um, it's probably close to being dinner time here. Let's do that. Alright, let's go ahead and um, pick that up. 
Oh, I really hope this cave is good. Let's drink an herbal tea. This could kill me if the, if the cave's not good. Do a birch bark tea. Drink my fill. I'm not doing eight hours though. We're gonna do, I'm, I'm gonna, you know what? Screw that. I'm pumping everything I've got into this. That's the smart move. That's seven hours. Eight hours. This way I know that I can sleep through the night. Just do it. Just do it. Boom. Give me my health back. Okay. Not bad. It's almost morning. Still considered an outdoor fire, I guess, because it's, it's definitely lo longer than I thought it was going to be. Drink some more water. Three more hours. <laughs> Rabbits is like, we don't speak of Benicula. We wiped the family slate. That's funny. I need to drop something. Past time. We're almost out of calories, but I don't care. As soon as that runs out, I'm going to grab the charcoal off of that so we can do a little bit of, little bit of work here. Sixteen charcoal. Be nice if you could collect water from all the water sources in the game. Yeah. Break through the ice like you do with your with your um, crowbar and just get get fresh water out of the lake. You would think that that would make sense, right? Okay, guys, we are here at the uh, railroad line. I have how much? How much longer do I have? Two more hours. You know what? Nah, we're gonna go hang out here for two hours. I want to be done with my cabin fever, man. And we'll play around here for a minute. How long will be? Three hours. I figured it would take me about four hours to get to the new uh, map, and I'm, I was about right. We're three hours in, and so another hour. And we should be we should be done for the day. Yeah, so we, this is a good cave, man. This is a good cave. Sleep for two hours. If it, I, won't, I won't sleep for two hours, but all right. So I guess we're gonna let's pick this up, drink some more water, and then chill out for an hour until I, my my cabin fever goes away. There we go. Done. It's the bane of my existence, man. Not really anymore, though. I mean, you know, if you prep well enough, you should be fine. All right, let's go get this, uh, any special treats we might have in here. When they do the animal, by the way, if you've seen the, the video for the DLC, the very first scene is a timber wolf walking right by that train station. So when they do the the when they do the uh, the animal pass, they're gonna put uh, timber wolves in here. So be aware. Right now it's quiet and it's peaceful and it's nice and it's beautiful. But I expect to have timber wolves in here uh, once they do the animal pass. A life straw mod that'd be cool. I'm gonna okay. Where 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 are people getting the mods from? It's not. It's not from uh, from Steam, is it? Because if I get a mod my game for my next season, I need to know where to get it. I need. I, okay, I can look it up myself. But if you guys know off the top of your head, that'd be great. We got cattails in here, so let's get that for dinner tonight.
Do I know how to make holy water? I do. I got ordained as a, as a minister in my 20s. If I need to make holy water, I'll make holy water. I'll pull a Constantine on you. You won't even know, man. You're, uh, they're, uh, they're, they're going to, the Keanu's going to make a, another a Constantine movie. I really want them to bring him in. Um, I mean, as much as I like the other actor, what's his name that was in, uh, um, The Legends? I mean, Constantine was, I mean, uh, Keanu was always my Constantine. Always. I rewatched that movie a couple of weeks ago, too. Oh, you boiled the hell out of it. That's funny. That's funny. Okay. Let's see if we find... We're not going to find arrows here, though. You guys, everybody's giving me a hard time in the chat or in the in the comment sections of the videos when I could not find, I could not see that arrow that one day when we came and explored this. I was like, I don't see the arrow. I think you're lying to me. You're lying to me. Man. It was right here in this crack right there. But there are an interloper. Oh, my goodness. That's point. That's almost three quarters. That's three quarters of a gallon of, of gasoline, man. What a prize that is. Whoop, whoop. Dude, I'm not ditching that. That's a lot of weight. But you know what? I'll take it. That's amazing. We'll probably go back to the... Um, the whatchamacallit? The... Uh, You know what I think is funny? They put these three cars side by side because when the Timberwolves are coming through here, you could jump from vehicle to vehicle to vehicle to the train station. Now I forgot what I was saying. What? What are you talking about, Will? I don't understand. We're losing health. I think it's in production. Or it's in pre-production. I think. I think. I could be wrong. But I tell you what I was not wrong about was everybody was getting all... all, all, all and I'm going to say it like this and I don't mean... Any, I don't, don't take offense. Whenever everybody's getting pissy about Henry Cavill... Um, not getting his uh, his Superman uh, uh, sh uh, cape back on because they canceled because James Gunn is going to redo uh, the the whole universe. Um, I said before I even read it that I thought that Henry Cavill was going to do a Warhammer a Warhammer series, and I was one hundred percent right. He talked with Amazon. He's got a, he, He's he's gonna he's gonna. I don't know if he's gonna be. He's probably going to be, I don't know if he's going to be a producer, but he's definitely going to be one of the main characters. I don't know if he'll be the emperor or not, but he's definitely going to be, um, he's putting together a Warhammer. I think it's a series. I don't think it's a movie. Because Amazon's only interested in big, big budget stuff right now. Like the Rings of Power. I'm kind of heavy. We should probably drop some stuff. What was that on the counter? What counter? Oh, there's several counters here. Were there matches? There were matches. You know what? Twice I've been through here, and twice there were matches, and I don't see any matches. There's nothing on this counter. 
Just a chair. Nothing here. Do I have any thoughts about Spawn? Yeah, they should redo it. 100%. I like that movie. He never talked to anybody else at the store, Amy, because he likes you. He just doesn't know how to make the first move. Just go do it. Just text him. Driving me crazy. And I bet you he'll dash right to your door. I'm going to drop this water. See what else can I drop? I can drop my bedroll. We're not. I could drop a lot of stuff, but we're not gonna. Let's just go. That's good enough. Forty k, Grant. He's doing forty k. The Last of Us is going to be awesome. Um, I like that. I like that. I don't know what the actress's name is, but she played um, one of the um, heads of the houses in uh, in Game of Thrones, and she did a pretty good job. For being as young as she was, she did a pretty good damn good job. I thought she she'll make she'll make an okay Ellie, uh, and um, and oh, is there nothing here? Lame. Lame. Oh, whatever, dude. What was it about Cavill and 40K? Yeah, he's gonna be he's gonna he's he's made a deal with Amazon. They're in pre-production right now. So everybody was mad because he wasn't on the because he left Witcher and he won't he won't be getting into he won't be able to be Superman again. And um and he uh, this whole time he already had that planned out. I know he had it planned out. He's been talking about Warhammer for years now. And he did in his Instagram post. He said, "I've been, um, I've been a fan of Warhammer. I've been playing Warhammer for thirty years, and I and I've been in the in, in the industry for twenty two years. Something I'm paraphrasing. Uh, and I think I could I can bring something to this. And so thanks to Amazon, uh, we're gonna do it. And I was like, yeah, I know nothing about Warhammer, but yeah, I know nothing about Warhammer, not a damn thing." I need to go read the lore. Like, was it books before it was something? Before it was um, a game, or was it always just a game? Check for church. What church? I'm gonna head out, man. I'm like ready to go. And a few cattails. Just let me get warmed up right quick. We get warmed up once. And then I'm going to go out and get some more kerchers. What torch? Actually, I'm not going to get cattails. We're heading up the road. I'm heavy. Like, I'm way heavy. Let's, um... Hang on. Was a game first? It was a tabletop game, then the and then there were books. Okay. And then okay. Alright, cool. So it was it was it was like Dun Dungeons and Dragons. 
Oh, I'm going to drop half of that. That's what we'll do. I mean, obviously, it has nothing it is nothing like Dungeons & Dragons, but it's a, it was a, a tabletop RPG. All right. I'm still over by 20. It's only poundage. Oh, that's right. Man, I don't want to pass it up, dude. Maybe we'll we'll drag this over to the other trailer. Let's do that. It's going to be slow going, guys, but we got time. Uh, you broke down and bought the long dark at the behest of your daughters after what seems like a decade of watching uh, Stacy play as your eyes, you and uh, and I'll play here on YouTube. A decade, dude! I haven't been playing for a decade. I only started making videos like two years ago, in 2020. That was my first 500 day run. I have been playing it for almost a decade though. But I sucked because I didn't I didn't know the maps. That was my main downfall. I had to learn the maps. And you know what? The maps online are, are good enough to to make you good enough to play. And I'm 29. I've been playing since yeah. I've been playing since I was 19. It was a tabletop army command game is how it started. Oh, cool. Right on. I own every piece of digital Dungeons and Dragons uh, um, stuff. But because I, until I can, until I can work out how I'm going to DM a group of people and still have time to like not kill myself. That's a joke, by the way. Um. Like, I, 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 I started putting so much on my plate for next year that I was just like, it took entirely too much time to do what I was trying to do with my D&D. I have three episodes where I was, you guys can see uh, what I was trying to do with Hellspire, but it's just too much if I'm doing other things. Don't you have a 30-year-old son? I'm a time traveler. Jennifer, yes, it's true. All right, here we go. But I had to come back in time before Elon became president because I just I couldn't handle that, man. Elon can't be president. He wasn't born in the United States of America. Oh. Yeah, I know. Blood for the blood god. Should probably start picking up sticks even though I can't hardly move. Let's go. It's not that cold. Kind of. Yeah, President of Mars. That's what it was. Yeah. That's it. Didn't think of coming back before 2016. Stop on that. Nah, you know what? I don't interfere in the timeline. That's when they come looking for you. Time cops, man, they come. You, you don't want them knocking on your door. Because if you make a, if you make that big of a mistake, you know that you're just done. Okay, let's stop. Let's stop our politics, okay? I'm here to play a video game and talk about other things like pop culture. That's cool. One single rose hip and a new chocolate bar. 
All right. So that new chocolate bar made me feel good. For a second, I thought they were trolling me. Wait, whoop. Visors. Check your visors. Okay. Time cops. Yeah, time cops. You didn't know I was a time traveler? Beetle. Oh, man. It nearly killed me last time. It's, it's hard on the body, man. If they come to your prison cell and they say they want you to help them out, just don't do it. Just don't do it. No matter what they offer. You get stuck back in time. The food's not as good. Technology sucks. Medicine is almost non-existent. Ugh. It's horrible. <laughs> Popcorn culture. Can you climb that tree? Probably not. I don't think so. It's too steep. Oh, I'm so heavy, but you know what? I hate moving. God dang it, man. Moving sucks. Why am I stuck? What's going on? I'm just stuck. Okay. I have my whole life on my back. Going to the new country. From the old country. I'm emigrating. It's a land of hope and opportunity. I've never felt so cold in my life. Bear with me. Movies are the top five worst things. Yeah, I brought the rifle. That's one of the reasons why I'm so heavy. I brought everything with me that I thought I'd need for the long haul. Because I don't think we're going to be here for... I mean, we'll probably hang out for um, a bit. We'll probably stay here and, and map it out again. And... Um, have fun with a sleeping bear. They snore now. You guys remember when I when I, when I was in um, Bleak Inlet and that bear was laying down and I thought it was dead and it attacked me. <laughs> it was just sleeping. Well, they let they made him snore now, so at least you know that they're sleeping and not dead. It was awesome when we came across the uh, the new bear. Moving can be good for the soul. Well, I was told that um, that I, I I can't sell the house because uh, because she didn't want to move. She's like, I hate moving. I'm like, all right, guess we're here till I die, or until you do. I'm kidding, <laughs> joking. <laughs> That's not even funny, but I chuckle because I joke. I kid, I kid. That was kind of a dick thing to say, though. It's a good thing she can't hear me. Come on. Yeah, let's go. Never touch a sleeping bear. No, you're not wrong. Then again, she was the one that bought a chainsaw. All right, I'm going to get warmed up here. I know we're right here, but I'm going to get warmed up. Oh, stop, 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 stop. I don't walk. Yeah, I'm, I'm warming up right now. 
We got enough time, we can stay here for an hour. I'm gonna sleep for an hour. Nurgle. Is that really a name of a god? Nurgle. Sounds like something you do to your little your little brother. I I, I held him down and I gave him a Nurgle. Yeah, I'll read all the lore. I'll get into it. If they're gonna make a, if they're gonna make a, a, a TV show out of it, I'm I'll I'll, I'll get into it and uh, check it out. Okay, guys, we are getting, I think we're here, but actually we are here. This is the Forsaken Airfield. We are here on the map. I'm going to go down to the trailer and we're going to unload a bunch of stuff. And we'll come back for it later. Where's the good stuff? Where's the good stuff? Hey, I'll take a bullet. Look, there's just one bullet left. You know what to do. What do you mean? What do you mean I know what to do? Battery! Uh, nope. <laughs> Imagine having no trees on your property and and and, and your wife come, brings home a chainsaw. Uh-huh. Honest, honey. I've just bought it so we can cut the brisket tonight. Mm-hmm. Is that what you're going to call it? Cutting the brisket? Yep. Okay. Don't mind me. Zzz. It's an electric chainsaw. It's like a six-inch blade. <laughs> We've been talking about this for, like, months. I want this chainsaw. I want this. She keeps seeing it on YouTube and the and the ads, and I'm like, you don't want that chainsaw. It's a six-inch blade. But I can, cut tree I can cut limbs off of our trees with it. Okay. Whatever. And then, unfortunately, her hands aren't strong enough to push the button. So she can pull the trigger. There's a safety button on there. So I'm going to take it to the chainsaw guy that's in town. And I'm going to see, see if they can get rid of that button so she can use it. Because that's always, that's always the thing to do. Remove the safety feature. Car Wars? No. Yeah, no, I'd be sleeping. I'd be sleeping if she came at me with a chainsaw. I'd have to be. <laughs> All right, we're almost to we're almost to the to the um, to the trailer, guys. I swear. What's flex pay? I don't know what that is. You heard if you nurgle your brother in certain states, they give you five to ten. Yeah, it's true. It's true. They couldn't prove it though, so that's why I got I got away from it. I got out of it. They could never prove it. You bought that chainsaw and can't push the button, Becca? Yeah. Um, it's And it's not easy for me either. Um, I'm going to see if the, if the chainsaw guy can... I, I could probably pull it apart, but I don't want to be in trouble if, in, if, if I break it. So <laughs> I'm going to take it to a repairman. And I get to get a new chain I, for, my, for my, my chainsaw too. I bought a 12-inch a, a, a blader, or 16-inch, I think, or something. And then I immediately ruined my blade. <laughs> I can sharpen it, but I think I smoked the metal. It was a crappy-ass blade. Walmart special, man. Electric chainsaws. The new thing. 
Is what monthly payments is the flex play for infom uh, from infomercials? All right, I think we're here. I'm moving really, really, really super slow. Obviously, you guys can see that, but I don't want to drop any of my gear right now. We're gonna have to here pretty soon. God, I'm down to half health too. Of course, I get hit with a fog right before we get where we're going. Come on, man. Criminy. You're killing me, dude. I'm still picking up stuff. Where are you, man? I'm about ready to just dump a pile of stuff down, but. No, here we are. It's right ahead of me. Okay, all right, we're good. I was beginning to worry that maybe I had misremembered, but it's right here. We're good. Okay. Up and over. All right, let's drop all our firewood right here because this is where we're going to be building our fire when we get it. Um, Cold is making my head feel faint. Yeah, 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 yeah. We're going inside in a minute, buddy. Just relax. That's better. We get. Warmed up, probably crash out. Okay. If a big cat spawned, well, that would be a nightmare, because I definitely would wouldn't have been able to get away, and I'm ha I'm almost half health, so that would have been terrible. What's in the box, Jack? What have we here? No, I don't care about that. Well, how much food do I have? Six cattails, a decent candy bar. The rest of it is trash. That'd get me through the night if I drink a tea. It could probably get me back up to where I need to be, and I've got half a gallon of water, so we're okay on that. Um, I'm going to drop my jerry can of fuel here after we fill our lantern. That helped a lot. Let's go outside and drop this charcoal. Hey, Polaroid. Cool. What a shot, can't believe we got up there. Oh, cool. We know where the vista is, so that's cool. I'll keep running as long as my hands hold up. The old road can't 
all, be all broken. I didn't fly in here, and there's no way that they can make me fly out, no matter what the hell they say is going on. That sounds familiar. All right. Okay. We're going to have plenty of acorns when it comes time. That's an oak tree. We're just kind of going back in here to see what's back here. It's foggy, so I can't use the charcoal right now, so... All right, so we're here. Let's go ahead and crash out, get some food in us. Okay. All right, uh, actually, let me put that where I can, I'm going to be able to see it when I come in the door. Okay, so I guess what we'll do, wait, what's in here? Nothing? Nothing. All right, so it is day 49, almost day 50. Let's go ahead and let's, um, let's eat, hopefully stuff that's not going to make me sick. Drink that soda. And all six cattails. Save this rotten food for later. I mean, nothing like having a uh, sardine party, right? Am I right? Because that's what three, six, nine, and five hundred is fourteen hundred calories. That's half a day's worth of calories if I'm not sick. But I will get sick. 100% guarantee you. I've been wrong before, though. Occasionally it surprises me. Yes, it was five pounds of matches. You know why? Because I plan on being here for the next 450 days. All right, we're going to go ahead and sleep for nine hours. Let's see what we can do. Almost full health already right here. Yep, it is, it is. And then what I think I'm going to do, since I'm so close, let's go ahead and eat these nasty foods and fill our belly. Because that's almost, I'm almost full health, so let's eat these nasty uh, sardines. Take some antibiotics. If I get sick, I'm leaving that 7% for the last one. Eat it! I didn't get sick? Uh-uh. No way did I not get sick. I was hoping to sleep for 10 hours, man. Whatever. Guess I'm just going to hang out then. Uh, even if I don't have enough... Uh, 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 I mean, I have some. Uh, we have... Yeah, I've got, what... 14. That's good for seven batches of bad food. Um, see, let's wait for another two hours. I was very lucky this time. Yep. Pleasantly surprised. Let's go ahead and let's drink that. We're going to crash out for... 
however long it lets me. All right. Well, it is day 50, guys. Here comes a blizzard, of course. And uh, we've got a bunch of firewood outside, so I'm going to be able to boil some water once the, once the storm clears. And we're gonna be, I'm going to go out hunting if it's clear, and we're going to go get some rabbits uh, tomorrow. Let's we'll see what we're going to do after that. But right now, guys, I think that's where we're going to leave it. We are here at the airfield uh, map with one little baby. <laughs> one little baby. Airfield Vistra opened up. So we'll start mapping this thing out again. Um, and we'll take our time and we'll, we'll actually start to build a life here for the next 450 days or until I get killed, which is very highly possible. But anyway, guys, I think that's where we're going to leave it. Thank you very much for coming in. I hope you all enjoyed it. If you did, please give me a thumbs up. And if I've earned your subscription, hit that sub button and that bell icon for notifications. And as I always say, I am my usual me. You be your usual you. And we'll see you in the next one. Thank you so much for watching, guys. And we'll see you later. And uh, Zeus loves you and I love you too. Here's Zeus. Bye.